on today's episode, you guys will get to see a vlog or a vlog, whatever, V, V, L, okay, y'all will get to see the vlog of me and my girls, Connie Foster on Instagram, Slay by me, and we are going to go and travel to Miami, Florida to Jolie Plastic Surgery to get their V, V, L, because I'm such an awesome fucking friend, and I want all my friends to get an ass, and I'm going to get these lopsided titties fixed, so follow Jolie, follow Connie Monster, and follow Slay by me. Okay, y'all ready? And now we about to do this motherfucking taco. Do something hungry. Right. And then you always taco. <laughs> Bust down the piano. Yeah. Yes. Come on, show them your flat ass for the last Look, day. This, this is the last day. day. No more. None of this. Let's show them your flat ass. Tomorrow, their ass will no longer be flat. It's going to be flat, bitch. Yeah, and these titties are going to fix. This one hard. Look, you hear it? Hey YouTube family, so we are on the way to Miami and it was Connie's birthday and we are going to meet Connie at the Miami airport. So we are now at Atlanta airport and we're headed over there and we are going to Jolie Plastic Surgery so Ming and Connie can get a booty. Who's going to get a booty? Oh shit. <laughs> And um, I am getting my boob fixed. So if y'all don't know, I have saline implants right now, and I am going to get gummy bears. So we're about to board a flight and meet up with Connie. So excited! I am so excited for y'all to see our Airbnb, and I am not gonna get robbed this time because our Airbnb is on the 48th floor. So I dare somebody come through that window and rob me this time. <laughs> Period. It's time to board. Alright guys, love you. Let's go. City is YouTube. Look at that. And it literally just cuts off. Ooh, that's even prettier. Look at all those lights. Well, what's right here for it to cut off like a perfect square like that? I know I made this video before on Instagram, right? But people in the back of the plane always rush up, right? So they rush up and they all end up just standing. Like, just all stand. And nobody moves anywhere because literally the plane is this row, and then this row, and then this row, and then this row. And you have to wait your turn. But no. We'd rather just stand. Okay. Look at your eyes. No. Mandy did her makeup. Well, she didn't do the rest. She did my eyebrow. Good job for the plane. All right, we're about to pick up Connie. Connie, where are you? Oh, there you are. <laughs> are you ready for your new booty? Ooh, poke it out. Say bye bye to this ass and this ass. Happy birthday, Connie. Thank you. <laughs> All right. I said it yesterday. I talked to your so we made it. 
bike to Chile. We need to go find Enterprise. Any luck? I'm hungry. Both of y'all hungry. Okay, let's go find our Enterprise. So, uh, we got a rental. We got a big Suburban because the boys are coming tomorrow so they can take care of us. So, we need more seats. And these bitches, after their surgery, they can't sit down, so we need space. <laughs> so we're eating right here at Miss Saigon. And Connie decides to leave us first because she's hungry. But she's been walking up and down, not able to find a place. Where were you going? So you didn't see this? Oh no. No, you didn't see where it says Miss Saigon. You had no idea, huh? Look at these beautiful yeah, things. Give me that menu. I'm hungry as shit. So aggressive. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. You don't want to joke and shit. So beautiful. I love those little fringy things. Let me show you guys. It's just like blowing in the wind. You see it? Like they tie these little fringy things to the top look and the wind is just blowing it how pretty is that look youtube look how many fucking floors it is uh put the motherfucking button this is a long as um 44 45 it's on flying I feel like I'm high as shit. You know how you just feel it? Yeah, I feel scared. <laughs> Which way? Hello. 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 Wow. Look at our view, bitch. It's beautiful. Where's the second room? Oh, there's a oh, there's a pull out. Oh, so we're definitely intact with each other. <laughs> That's why. Wow, the view is to die for. Well, we're here, guys. Tomorrow is our pre-op. Oh my god. Is it this one? No. Oh my god, it's like marble floors out here. Oh, oh my god, my it's so high. Fucking god. Home, oh, it just made me want to pee. Oh my god, it's so high. Oh, it's so high. My heart is thumping. It's, it's so super high. high. It's so beautiful. Okay, everybody, today is our pre op. This is the day that we go talk to the doctor about what we're going to get. Um, and what time and scheduling and stuff like that. Ta-da! So Connie has fucking high blood pressure because this bitch eat candy all day. And low iron, so she's been having to take iron pills. And because she keeps eating fucking sugar. She's still eating fucking gummy bear. Bitch, they told you your mm. sugar is too high. Me and main fat ass is good, healthy, high in iron. <laughs> So we just pulled up to the joint. I'm anemic, bitch. Um, <laughs> yeah, you fucking sickening. You need to eat. That's because she's so sucked dick because of her braces. That's why her iron is low. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, <clears throat> Jolie <clears throat> is actually only like five minutes from the airport. Uh, we got a Airbnb about 20 minutes away. So it's very convenient. It's not far from the airport. So if you're ever interested to go in here, it's at a busy shopping center, actually. Um, I've got my body done in a lot of different places. Uh, in Bowie, when I first got my boob done, it was in a, it was in a building, like an office building. Then I got lipo somewhere down Georgetown. It's a fucking building. I got my ass shots in my house. Um, <laughs> and then I got, you know, Dr. Curry, he has his own facility. So this is actually at a very busy shopping center, but only 10 But it's their own, their own facility though. Yeah. Everything is And they're board certified. Here, yeah. Mm-hmm. 
All right, let's go check out our doctors. Um, there's multiple doctors here. Let's go check it out. Jolie. And I'm about to walk in. <laughs> it's very nice and smells amazing. Hello. Oh, look at my little booty bitch is about to get some ass. Bam. Oh my God. I Bam. So <laughs> your butt. Hello, how are you? Hey. Cindy been talking to us and coordinate with all this way. I got you guys booked for surgery. Yay! And this is the beautiful motto of Joe Hi, Lee. Show them your booty. Ah! Ooh, mommy. Making mommy. me sweat. <laughs> oh my so, it's very nice. Sorry. Hey, girl. It's really cute. It smells good. The staffs are nice. And there's people waiting. <laughs> Sorry, oh my God. Everybody, look at her ass. Damn! <laughs> I want her doctor. I want her doctor. Everybody got a fat ass in here. Her ass is fat. His ass is fat. Oh. I'll be back. Everybody. Everybody ass is fat. Let me see your ass. <laughs> Yeah, but, oh yeah, you need a BBL, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody else. You get an ass, mama? You get an ass? You want an ass? No. Just a little bit. I need a little bit. I want some pussy about my daughter. Oh, nice. So we're gonna do it at the same time. Yes. You better call Tara. Come take care of me. Everybody, so everybody has a fat ass, you guys. Pass it down, Papi. Pass it down, Papi. Are you excited? I'm very excited. I'm hey, nervous. Just seeing all these butts make you happy. Yes. I want big Hello, booty. Mommy. <laughs> you gonna get a big duty because you have enough to put in. You're gonna take all that, all that. Everything. You already have back though. Connie got the back. You already have butt too. So it's gonna be out. Cuffage, sis. Cuffage. Wait till that joint get real fat. <laughs> she gonna get rid of this. Look at that. And we gonna put that right here. <laughs> I got a little cuffage too. You gotta, girl, you gotta get the angle for you to cuffage. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Okay, now I'm just getting my boobs fixed, so. This is hard, that's it. Okay, we're waiting for the doctor to come out and talk to us. Vitamin C is beneficial, so we normally tell patients to take iron with vitamin C. That's what I do, I take vitamin C and that's iron fine. together. That's fine, that's, that's excellent. Okay. So keep doing that. Okay, good. So I don't have to stop? No, don't stop, by all means continue. Okay. But like a multivitamin, there's really no need. You know, so just in case. Yeah, just cause it to bleed the other time also. Okay. That's so cool. You too. Oh, yes, you too. Hey, folks, Everybody's so very interested. A lot of women want their butt done and they just don't big. know what kind of where to go and stuff right. like that. Yeah, right and if they're a good candidate. Well, of course, you know. of course, yeah. Well, so I don't got too. no question. I just wanted sure. to snatch my body. Okay, <laughs> right. She wants as big as possible. Because I know as big as possible. I don't want to be proportional. I don't want to look crazy. She would like to look like She would like to look like an ant. No. <laughs> <laughs> like a kid. So good. So what I need to do, I need to talk with you guys, like behind closed doors and then do an exam mm -hmm. to see you know what we're working with and then I can let you know what expectations, you know, what limitations that we have and you know what you know how we can how we can sculpt you. Okay, okay. Okay, right, let's go. Oh we're going. Okay, let's go. Say hi to the Say bye to the ass. We're live right now. We're here oh, with Dr. Yay. Brewster. Yay. The booty doctor of the year. Well, what I can do, I can just um, look at the areas that we, you know, put the fat from, and then we can assess that, and then, you know, if I, I won't record you more, naked. Correct, yeah, if I need to see more, then we'll have to stop videotaping, whatever makes you feel comfortable. Okay. 
Okay, that's all I like. I mean, I already waxed, so you know. Right. I'm going to say, I'm shaving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, no, everything is going to be, um, you know, uh, looked at. So they're very good. They're very good. The guys here are very, very good. And, okay. they, you know, they'll, they'll put it, they'll run it by you guys first before it goes, you know, live. I don't even want to look at myself until after. No, sorry. <laughs> what we can do, I can just have you uh, expose, like, the tummy and the, the back, which is the main areas by which we, the, from which we're going to take the fat from. Right. Right, and then um, if I need to see more areas, I can then you know have you guys you know get dressed or okay. undressed. Okay. Yes. All right. All right. Okay, guys, I'm gonna have a seat. Okay, my dear. So you're 31. So my first question is, why the transformation? What, what's the whole you know reason behind it? Why do you wanna change the, the body shape? I need to get rid of this 11-year-old uh, fupa, <laughs> <laughs> and I just wanna be snatched. So I owe it to myself to be healthier and, you know, so hopefully after this, I'll get into better shape and I just want to be True. in good shape. That's it. Excellent. That's yeah. good. And right, you want an ass so you can throw it back. <laughs> According to Mimi, I want an ass. Cool. <laughs> to throw it back. To throw, throw it, it back. back. There, there you go. go. You can write that down too. No, I did. I did. I have it. So, but, so the main, yeah, but the main reason. Well, this, this is because you're doing it for yourself. Mm -hmm. right? I'm doing it for good. myself. For my self confidence. That's excellent. Mm -hmm. And Mimi's. And Mimi's. <laughs> no. Are you guys related? Are you guys cousins or sisters or family? We, we call each other by family. Oh, yeah. That's excellent. Yeah. And, which, uh, and what background? Is it um, Korean? No, I'm Cambodian and Chinese. That's, so that's a beautiful mix. That's beautiful mm -hmm. mix. And what about you? I'm Vietnamese and Gibraltar. Oh, wow. <laughs> <That's cool. laughs> All right. Okay. So where are you coming from? What state? I am. Um, I'm originally from Virginia, but I live in Maryland. So I'm from the District um, of Columbia, so DC metropolitan DC, area. That's like yeah. Capital. Mm -hmm. uh, what type of job do you do? Um, I'm a grants assistant. Okay. So I sit behind a desk all day. Good for you. Mm -hmm. no, I hear you. Okay. Do you smoke, drink, use any illegal drugs? Anything? No, I don't drink. I smoked up until five, 45 days ago. So Very I'm, good. So tobacco? Was it tobacco? Yes. Okay. Vietnamese Asian woman, somehow we smoke cigarettes. You it's really know, bad habit. Anymore. You know, you stopped okay, 45 days ago. Now, um, do you smoke weed? No. Very good. None of us I'm do. Boring. It makes us slow it's for some boring. reason. <laughs> I'm boring. I don't think <laughs> We'd be very stupid <laughs> on weed, so it doesn't work out. Me. Please. Huh? Oh, fuck you. You smoke this. Quiet on set, please. You guys are packing me up. Okay, what price of surgeries have you had? I don't have it. Um, in the past, sorry, like what surgeries have you, you know, had done to the body? Like dental surgeries? Have you had any? Yeah, I had like root canals and got put to sleep for like, um, getting my tooth pulled. Right. I'm a baby, so I had to get my general anesthesia. No, that's fine. I had right. mine with general anesthesia as well. Yeah, I was put to sleep. Yeah. yeah. But that's, that's it. I didn't do nothing else. But did, did you have any reactions due to the anesthesia? Any complications? Anybody yeah. bleeding? No, no, nothing like that? No. All right. Um, any admissions to hospital in the past? Um, no. No? Okay. Are you from South Africa? Close. My mom is from South Africa. I I'm can from, I'm hear from the a accent. small island off the coast of Venezuela. It's called Trinidad and Tobago. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. It's a boring place. It's not boring. <laughs> it's <laughs> lovely. Yeah, it's very small. Very small. Your, it's ac like your accent like, is very... Very nice. Yeah, it's very... I, I like you. <laughs> you're welcome. I didn't get to say that, but you're welcome. <laughs> 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 any allergies to medications, no. to latex, to food? No. No, good job. What medications are you on? You mentioned iron and vitamin C. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's it? Okay. All right. And then um, any medical problems in the past? Asthma, you know, diabetes, hypertension, anything like that? Mm -hmm. Anyone in the family with any bleeding problems, blood clots? No. No cancers? Okay, good. All right, my dear. So technically, you're very healthy. You know, you, you're a very healthy person and, and, and it's very good. You should be commended. Um, we still have to do some lab work on you. Did we do labs? Yeah, yeah we did. Labs. Okay, brilliant. So we'll take a look at those. Um, we also recommend um, actually an EKG. Um, have you had any problems? You said no. So, well, yeah. So at this point, just lab work we'll need. Um, okay, so I'm just going to move on. I'm just going to get my hands cleaned and I'm going to take a look and have you. Um, no, is that a one piece? Or yes, it's a one piece. Okay. No. How can um, it's okay if I, I need to take a look at the tummy area. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. It's okay. So I, I can't know. blur it. So. Yeah. Okay. so we're gonna take a look at. I the, can't hear you. Have you had kids? Pregnancy? How many? <coughs> I didn't have any kids. Okay. Um, I had a 
the look of it, it's five, but I only had one. <laughs> no, it's okay, it's always fine. So, yeah, so we call this dermatocolysis, and you know, the fat, on, you know, if you blow up, I call yeah. it lipodystrophy. So, you know, you do have, you know, lower abdominal, it's expected, you know, mm -hmm. it's because of pregnancy, you know, the, the, the term for stretch marks are striate, so you have striate to the lower um, abdomen. Um, what we can do to help you is that we can call, we can actually, you know, chisel this area and mm -hmm. remove a lot of fat from the waist to mm -hmm. give you a more snatched appearance, mm -hmm. a smaller waist, all right? We can actually, I think you'll be a good candidate. We will help, you know, remove this area, this the fat from this area as well. And I'll be turning to the side. Yeah. On the side, as I said before, we'll help you in, in this area, the waist. The more as high as your upper back, in terms of your liposuction to the back. Yeah. And then we'll start here in the upper back. We'll work the, the flank areas as well as the, the lower waist. Oh, that's so good. All right. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think, yeah, I think, yeah, Vivian will help you out. Help you a great deal. So that was fun bottle shape, so. <laughs> yeah, so give you more of a Coke, uh, Coke bottle shape. Okay, good. <laughs> All right. Did you go cover like a Pepsi? <laughs> no. I'm just joking. You're going to be a Coca-Cola baby. For the, but for the, um, the stretch mark, the skin that has been affected by the stretch marks, um, that might not improve after lipo in terms of um, getting totally flat. Right. So, um, if you want like a, a totally flat, you know, appearance to the, mm -hmm. the anterior abdomen, you probably need what's called a tummy tuck or a lipo abdominoplasty. Okay. All right. But so far, I think you'd be a very good candidate for the DVL. Okay. All right. Okay. So, because it's going to be a lot of loose skin, so I'm going to need to do, like probably later on down the road do a Correct. tummy tuck. Correct. Like, so there's no way to like do them at the same time. No, not at the same time, but there's no way to like work it out to try to. Right, so we will we will do um, something to help, you know, with the, with the skin tightening. Okay. You know, it doesn't always, you know, it doesn't work for everyone. Okay. So, you know, we can wait for a period of six months. Mm -hmm. You know, that's when we'll know if your skin, you know, you know tightened over the, the, the new volume of, of fat. Mm -hmm. um, or if the skin is very saggy. And, okay. you know, if that's bothering you at that point, we can, we can move on and give you options like a tummy tuck. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. No problem. Thank you. No problem. All right. Hold my ears. So this is your yeah. So I think for you, my dear, you'll be very a good candidate for liposuction. Mm -hmm. So what liposuction can guarantee you is a fifty percent reduction in your skin pinch. So in this area, we can really help you reduce the the volume of fat. All right. I'm just gonna yeah. So we can really help reduce this. I'll have you turn around for me. <laughs> Tickles. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, so mm -hmm. so I think we can definitely help you here. We'll give you the best back in terms of your transition between the lower back and the, mm -hmm. and the yeah, put your forward. All right. So show me, guys. What what pictures do you want to? Oh, you know, I got pictures. Show me. Hold up. I got pictures. Yeah. Show me which pics. Yeah. Signature pics. Sorry. Left-handed. Mm -hmm. Especially. Left. And one of my pictures. Mm -hmm. Ming, tell us why you want to get a BBL again. <laughs> Perfect you want to you want to drop down, Tatiana? You want to drop down? That's what you want to do. With the waist and get rid of that skin, I think that would be a problem. Okay. But I think we can we can help you with that. And we this is actually a shape that we we can achieve for you. Okay, let me see. Connie. It'll be fun. It'll be this fun. is what Connie would like to look like. Yay. Okay. You do have that right there. Oh, you want me to show me one of those type of pictures? Yeah, or, or any any kind of picture. Okay, so this is my picture, okay? <laughs> you see how the side of her butt is? I want it like oh, that, okay, right? Okay, okay. And then I want like the front to be like this. The front to be like that. Let's see. Okay. So snatch. Y'all see it? Yeah, yeah. Side, mm -hmm. front. Okay. So you want hips? Yes, yes I want. You have to spread. We are supposed to waste. You have to have a baby, baby to spread them hips. <laughs> My hips didn't come until I had this. Well, look, I got a lot of fat and last skin, so yeah, it should. Yeah, I think we can help it you. It should expand. All right, guys. So moving forward, when? So when is the day? When tomorrow. Do we, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Oh, high five. You didn't know that? No, I, I knew that. <laughs> I think if you guys did. I was about to say, wait, we fly all this way. Right. <laughs>
I'm looking forward. I'm looking forward, guys. All right, so we just have to look through your labs, and um, and then you guys, none of you guys have any medical issues, nothing like that. Yeah, so it should just be labs. And, and so who's giving me the anesthesia? Um, I can find out. I can find out for you. Okay, so we set our lab, so you guys can see this. Wow! Look at blue, girl. It's nice, big, and white, and shiny. This facility is much bigger. This is heaven. This is where I'm going to get my body done. This is where you're going to go. You're going into the light. Go into the light, Connie. Into the light. So Marsha's going to be coming into the light with a big booty. Yup. So basically, we added more rooms. Um, obviously, you know, there's the massages, no? injections. We're gonna have our own. We're gonna have our own recovery room. Oh, that was what I was Oh, so these wow. are brand new. Yeah, it's not new. We're still, we're still fixing it. We're not done yet. And you so, said you got massage room? Or no, the massage rooms. Room. So we're gonna change yeah. everything around, but more like so you can know. Um, the doctors will be seeing the most of the patients here, the right here. So you can see this is how fresh it is. That this is gonna be the recovery area for patients like. Let's say you bring your mom, your cousin, they're gonna be right here hanging out, waiting for you to have surgery. Okay, so, so we're gonna start in here, girl. ¿Qué está comiendo? ¿Qué está comiendo? <laughs> she said she's eating some Cuban food. Ooh, mm, that sounds good right now. So yeah, just so you can see, this is uh, very spacious. Mm -hmm. Very blue. You guys like it. I hope you feel welcomed. And this is see, basically, mommy. <laughs> this is all you. She has the biggest on her. I want to lick the damn floor. It is so beautiful. <laughs> Hold this, I want to feel the floor. Girl, touch the floor. Do that. What's that new floor? Oh, it's like super new. Look what I can do. Look what I can do. Okay. All right, so now I'm ready. You guys have to try your garments on. Just wanted to feel the floor, you know? It's something about your garments, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sniff the walls. It's fresh. Hurry, like. The one, the one. 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 Drugs, no ecstasy, cocaine, no marijuana, nicotine. But my birth, I just had my birthday over the weekend and I was around people. Get by so we're gonna find out if you pass that drug test. Okay. Oh man. <laughs> well, I don't do drugs. I don't know about y'all hoes. I don't do drugs either. I don't do drugs. <laughs> I don't know if I don't do drugs. I'm doing good without a cigarette for the last 45 minutes. <laughs> Me. Oh, okay. What is your name? Kanaka. Kanaka. Last name? Son. Yeah. <laughs> they already fucked up. That's why I came here to get them fixed. This is a very nice waiting room. See, you love yourself. Oh, y'all about to have some big butts tomorrow. You about to get rid of that roll, Connie. <laughs> <laughs> she said I had to choose a nail to cut down. Not the one with the bling. I told you, no, take no, all right. No, the, 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 the no, the heart. No, the heart. I like the heart one too. Did she do your nails? No. Can I just put on my no, toe or something? Nails? I told her no. stupid ass not to I put it on that finger. Mm -hmm. It was for my birthday this weekend. My guys. birthday was on Saturday. Mine was on Sunday. I'm Coming Python. down a runway, oh, long shit. ass band aid. Work, <laughs> work, work, work it, potato work sack. It. Work <laughs> it. Bitch, you look like a finger. Let me see the ass. Do we have a hole? Oh, look at that. <laughs> yes. so Let me see the pee? hole for you to pee. Lift up a leg. So you pee? Squat. A little bit. Open. Squat. That's how you pee. I mean, I squat anyway. But, but Asians squat. Asians squat. You don't want to sit on it. Yeah. yeah. You don't want to squat. I heard other like races can't, like white people can't squat. Like you know how Asian people squat? We just squat like this. Squat a little bit. Lift up your leg. Let me see the hole. A hole? Is there a hole? Yeah. 
Oh, there is a hole. <laughs> there is a hole. There it is. That's the big beetle. Bust it out, that's the other. Alright, so you guys are so I'll be great in the garment. Alright. After two weeks, you're probably gonna want to take it in on the sides to make it yeah. smaller. Okay. So we have that snatch look. So this is the faha, you guys. The dumba cheeks are gonna be different. They're not gonna look like that next time. No, I, I like, like my butt, my little butt cheeks. Y'all like my little butt cheeks? Be honest. No. <laughs> a little bit of an enhancement. Your little little. Un poquito, un poquito. Ah, un poquito. Culo. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. The Pisces girls. The Pisces girls. Yeah. It's my Here's birthday twenty. Where's yours? Oh, let's go. Okay, so can I take this off? Yeah, and then this is yours. Make sure you bring your garment with you for surgery. Okay? Inhale, in huh? forget it, big band aid. Yes, girl. <laughs> Work it. Just call it big band aid. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna play can can. Ace wrap. Ace wrap. Yes. You know when you break your wrist and you gotta wrap the ace, the ace band aid. <laughs> 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 Yay! Stop me, stop me, stop me, stop. So the zipper actually tightens up, or how does it tighten up? Okay, so she needs space in there to put in her boards, her abdominal board, oh, yeah. and her binders. Oh yeah, yeah, I need the boards. So it's the foams on the side, mm -hmm. and then in the front you're gonna have a flat board to push in to compress mm -hmm. against your abdominal area. You're gonna turn around. They're gonna put a, a triangle in your lower butt area, so you can have that nice dip on your back. Is it gonna fit all my things like this? Yeah. Mama, you're, you're listen. You're gonna be. Stuck. Yeah, you need oh, to be. Okay. It needs to be as They're tight as possible. Oh wow. Uh, That's gonna be filled with. Pop, Who's that? With <laughs> Who's that? He's, he's the puppy of the clinic. Really? He's the puppy. Oh, that puppy. Sent that one. Sent your head down. Who don't who that? <laughs> Not the one taking me to get tacos. That's who it is. Okay. All right, potato sack. Go change. <laughs> Any uh, medical issues, health issues, anything you might Does mental illness count? I'm just joking. <laughs> no, that, that's a criteria. <laughs> no, nothing wrong. Wonderful. You sure? <laughs> so, other than the breast augmentation, anything else? No. Unless you, you said, want to be tummy. Yes, you said no. You said liposuction. Oh, okay. Oh, I had it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you had the tummy tuck. Yep. Okay, when did you have the liposuction and tummy tuck? I had a tummy tuck. Uh, Last year. Last year. Last year in September. Okay. And the liposuction was when? Um, before my boobs. So five years. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now, do you have any allergies to any medications? No. Okay. Now, do you take any medications that a doctor prescribes to you? No. Okay, do you take anything that you prescribe no. for yourself or over the counter? No. Okay. How about diet medications? Anything for weight loss? Not yet. Not yet? Okay. <laughs> please, please don't. What about Percocet? I'm just joking. Probably <laughs> All right. Listen, um, I'm going to have you remove your top, mm -hmm. okay, so I can take some measurements and examine you and tell you what my opinion is, okay? okay? I did already see your pictures. I'm just, you know, much rather, you know, <laughs> how much volume, okay? And this way I can look in the system. the system and find out which one it is so I can get you the closest and maybe go a little bit bigger, okay? okay? When you go from silicone to, sa sorry, from saline to silicone, the conversion uh, is not direct. I have to, I have to choose uh, the implant according to the diameter and the height. Okay. okay. So the doctor did offer me a breast lift, but I don't want to do it because it's a lot more cutting and I think I want to have another baby for y'all. See how I said it for y'all? Um, <laughs> so I'm just going to get the implant switched out from the saline to the gummy bears. So I'm not going to do the breast lift just now because I'll wait for a little bit. It's a little saggy, but I can put on a bra. Okay. Thank you. I'm no, you bet. Any other questions? Um, no, I don't, okay. need, I don't need rubbing, nothing, right? Just wear the bra. Well, what you do is, I mean, you're going to have an incision under the oh, breast, right. okay? It's going to be about four centimeters. Mm -hmm. um, there's really nothing for you to do on the outside, mm -hmm. okay? Just uh, what you do is we'll put tape on the uh, incision. That tape comes off naturally by itself in about a week, and then you can use a scar cream. There's a, there's a variety of scar creams out there. Yeah. Oh, what about feeling? We can't. We don't know. I don't feel this nipple. Okay. But I don't know. 
but this is the soft one. Yeah. Then this is the hard one. And you feel it. And it be lit. Okay, so that's the thing with uh, sensation. Sensation can sometimes people have decreased sensation without even having surgery, just by the size of the breast. Right. Um, and you know, sometimes after an augmentation, which you obviously had an augmentation through the areola, and that has a higher chance of uh, having sensation changes. So coming under is. I think under. I don't think I'm gonna. Um, necessarily change it I don't think I'm gonna make it better okay. okay but there's always a chance that it can get a little bit worse I don't anticipate that mm -hmm. okay whatever happened already probably just happened and then you're gonna be probably the same for the rest of your life okay. has the sensation changed since the surgery yeah has it gone better have you started feeling more and this one I feel this, this one one's I don't zero feel. okay all right well I think it's gonna be the same I'd be like, wrong okay. titty, this one. <laughs> I have to tell the girls that. Okay, wonderful. All right, so if uh, you don't have any further questions, no, I'll it. see you tomorrow. But, see you tomorrow? But before, I before gotta call the, the end of the day, please, the before the end of the I'm work I'm doing right now. Okay. Yay, titties! New titties tomorrow. Oh. So we just picked up the boys from the airport so that they can take care of us tomorrow. Take care. Don't worry, I'm going to get drunk. Kenny. And Ham and Remy and Connie is so mad. I'm not mad. She's always mad. Be okay, nice to him. So you got a baby. He shark. drove a long way to help you wipe your ass so he can hit it. <laughs> huh. I'm just gonna have rest it in the tub. Let's go over. Oh, climb in the back. Who, who climbing the back? Move the, fold the chair. And now we got Remy. Remy, I don't think you should go back to this. Get the back, buddy. One, another person has to go back there. Oh, you want to see it? And then there goes Ham, who's like, why? I don't want to go back there. Fuck it. All right, now we're going to get surgery. Good morning, ladies. Are we ready? So we are packed up and in the car for them to get their booty and our husbands are here. Well, my husband, that means I need to get married. Um, <laughs> you ready, Connie? You nervous? Scared? <laughs> Pop bend over, let me say bye to the flat ass for the last time. No, no. This is the last time. This is the last time I'm all caught up. <laughs> All right, so we are driving. So we are driving now. The um, the facility is 20 minutes away from our our swiggly ass garage home or whatever we're staying at. So I, I'm not nervous. I'm used to this. <laughs> you know, I've been on drive so many times. So I will see y'all soon. And when I see y'all, y'all have to be fat. I need planet on my shirt. So I put on pajamas to be comfortable so that we just slip on. The bra. Got my bra. They got their stuff. And well, you'll see. I'm going to record some more at the office. And Mr. Tall. Mr. Talls. My back hurt. My arm booked some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> He said our Airbnb matches feel like a napkin. This is made out of napkins. <laughs> And there you have it. Cold. It's cold. I want it's cold. I want my drugs. Who go like up, bro? What's up with your drip? Dang. What's up with your drip, honey? Walmart. It's comfy on my asshole. What? Walmart? It's comfy. <laughs>
code. That is my Frio. Frio. Hey. Oh my. It's nice in here. I like the flows. You are much better shit than me. First day, this one is moving around like it's nothing. She's been around all day, just cussing people out back to normal. My poor baby Ming, she's in pain. <laughs> <laughs> Ming is in pain, but her ass fat though. Yes, snatch baby, snatch. Look, look at Connie's ass. Ooh. Yes, Connie. Bam. You would die if I smack it right now. I got a tattoo last night, you guys. So I've been waiting. Because, you know, last night I tried to get a tattoo on my stomach to cover up my scar, but it hurt so bad. So while I was on drugs yesterday, I got a tattoo. What is that? Tissue paper? I can't I'm going to just take your stuff and not put it back. I ain't got a picture. So we need to carry on with the pills, don't we? I need to go get me a brand new pair, too. Uh, I'm going to go with you. Purse? I ain't saying what you call it. Fanny pack goes around her waist. A purse goes around her shoulder. Hey, man, I don't call it nothing. <laughs> It'll go in the room. <laughs> Stop making a joke that hard. <laughs> hey, mom. You still want to go? So, I got my boobs. So, they cut down here. But this doesn't hurt. The tattoo hurt way more than this, y'all. You Connie is really moving around, right? Her recovery is awesome. Me on the other hand. Me on the other hand. You know what? It's it's because Ming is bigger than Connie. The more body fat you have, the more pain you're gonna go through because the more liposuction that you have to go through. Connie is a lot smaller, so she didn't have to go through much. 
Oh, and Remy actually made some bomb sandwiches. Where is it? You said he actually made some bomb sandwiches? Yeah, it was good. Are you, ready? Are you ready for your massage? We're going to get it today. It's going to make you feel better. It smushes out all the fluid. Who the fuck I perked a lot yesterday. Yeah, you did. You knocked it up. Sit on your butt. So in the car, you will have to kneel like this. Okay. Like little doggies. We got London on the train. Many different things. Instead of taking one tablet every four to six hourly of the opiates, you can take, um, you can double up on those, so you can do two. Um, and what's even better is that you can keep doing the one every four to six hourly, but um, add to that Motrin 800 milligrams, one tablet every, every eight hourly. So actually, you can do the Motrin like every eight hourly scheduled, mm -hmm. and then you can keep the Percocet, and then you can like every Four to six hours. If you have breakthrough pain, you can then do. But I don't got that much focus. Too, too long. Right, and that's actually we wish we could give you more, but um, because of DEA, um, you know, oversight and um, you know, there's a, there's a new practice involved in terms of how we, we, we treat pain here in Florida. Right. For acute pain, um, especially for, um, pain that is managed in outpatient um, surgery centers, we can't write for seven days anymore. We can't give you seven days worth of Percocet anymore. We cannot. Mm -hmm. we, we can only give you um, enough for three days. And then if you if you have pain after three days, we have to reevaluate you. We have to talk, sit you down, talk to you for like about half an hour about non-opioid pain substitutes like, Mo, like Motrin, Tylenol, you know. And then if, if the pain, if, and then we have to examine you. And then if the pain is due to like, you know, post-surgical changes like inflammation, and if in our judgment the motion is not helping, if the talons are helping, then we can we can rationalize that yes, that might be a good good outcome, a good substance. We need more drugs. <laughs> we need more drugs. Yeah. We yeah. need yeah. more yeah. drugs. Yeah. Up the dosage. Fall on the ground, bitch, right now. Oh. 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 She's waiting to get away when she's with, with me by, my, by herself. She's gonna be good. I'm having to do all the things we're expected. She's gonna have to do all the things we're expected. She's gonna have to Ooh, look at it. It's upside down. Where's the other one? Look at that booty. And see, there's more hips and those rows are out. All right. Go back to Connie. And... Oh, this was Connie's butt before. It's more square with these two things. Got you in the C shape right here on the side. Oh. And no upper butt right here. This. Yeah. Wow, and this is her butt afterwards. Nice and round. Her love handles are gone. Those indents are gone. Ooh, ladies, are you happy with your results? Yeah. Yay! It hurt. Good. Connie's not in pain like this. Because Connie now. listened to what I had to say. I drilled her like a sergeant, right? Yeah. Oh, you're you're defying. Like, you don't like to listen. What you mean? She said, I hate. I hate Pedialyte. <laughs> no, she was up and walking. You guys are going to drink Pedialyte, right? I'm going to go buy me another one. Probably like a strawberry. Do you have my boobs? No. Yeah. So so this was the capillary yeah. contraction. That's why my old yeah. boobs were hard. This shit had yeah. built up around my titties. Uh -huh. I didn't even know that titty had that much. Yeah, they are really Ew, so is that like dead skin or like hard tissue? Yeah, hard tissue that right. And this is the implant. old implant they took yeah. out. Wow. When can he hit it from the back? Back! The patients that take me three weeks, I have other patients to say three months. So you have, you know, her. remember her body's tender. Three months, I'm not okay. the, the way Connie's moving, you get three days. <laughs> right. <laughs> Her body is tender. Bing gonna be sucking dick. <laughs> <laughs> you know, her body is tender. 
Body punch. Punch. If right now you grab her by her hips, nine out of ten she's probably gonna punch you. <laughs> she's gonna yeah. So even if you if when you see her yeah, take a shower, if you rub her back a certain way, she's gonna flinch or. In the worst case oh, yeah, scenario, you're probably gonna faint. So you just gotta. She gonna, she gonna fight me. She gonna try to scratch me and punch me. That's what she did. So just you know, on her terms, basically, she'll know how it works, and always keep your garment on. So no taking off the garment. That's for sure. Okay. Okay. So, so we'll be back another one tomorrow. Or uh, or we might be getting one today. Okay. So when do the booty get soft again? When does the booty get soft? Like when she like hard right now. Right now, yeah. Okay. You just. I, I say in the next six weeks to two months. Okay. It's, you see how my butt is gonna like, like standing. It's gonna drop. Yes. Oh, is it gonna drop? Yes. It's, 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 it's like right it's now. the pants you're wearing. It's, the garment. It's the garment. It's the garment. The garment is lifting your butt up. That's what I'm saying. It's just like up. Oh, like, my booty gonna be like this. You got a, you got a BBL too. I did. Oh, okay. Three years ago. And I got my hips up. that. Nothing. So you only got a hip. Yeah, yeah but <laughs> since I gained weight, it's you can grab it. It's pretty heavy. It is heavy. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that is heavy. <laughs> so I got my hips done and not like you guys have a full BBL, you guys are going through much more pain because they packed you up. Remember you had a small so everything has to stretch out and the fat has to start, you know, surviving. Okay, yeah. so um drink a lot of water. And eat PBL. They say you, you can eat regularly, right? Um oh. I don't know if I would have to ask him. Cause I had a lot of fat. I don't know if you put everything in the booty or not. Oh, you didn't put everything. Yeah, I'm yeah. pretty sure. I'm pretty sure not everything. They were in there, but yeah, they should have. <laughs> <laughs> like, no. But his butt, his butt is huge. Yeah, but at the end, it's like eighty to forty percent of the fat is gonna stick, and some of it is not. And me and my sister went to Yeah, yeah. Yours will get fat with time. Everybody, oh, everybody, everybody, everybody's different. Yeah. Look at her. Turn around. She's so how, much, how much of that fat is gonna actually? Why are you not standing up straight? When you, you stand up straight, I'll look more curved. You're still. Yeah, she's still slouching. You're slouching. Connie's not slouching. Not because Connie, Connie, like, like, this one's been moving around all day like nothing. Just bitching. Like Connie's like, just. Like, she's good. Yeah. yeah. I'm mentally prepared for this. I'm so proud of you. No, I think I, I yesterday and the day before. Yeah. All three of them got to eat. Drake paid a lot. She said, eat normally, so I eat. So I didn't even take my own time. I took pain medication. Not yet. Not yet. But they have to use it. Yeah, they can use it. But you don't use it. The forms and the lipo forms. Yeah, they have it. Okay. So where do we where do we put the forms? Not yet. You don't use them yet. The the massage therapist will guide you one two because right now you're in the draining process. So if you start. Hello, Dr. Granny. Hey. Nice to see you. Look, we're matching. Excellent, excellent. How you feel? I feel great. My boobs doesn't hurt. I can't even feel it. I got a tattoo last night. Already? Look. You went and got a tattoo last night? Yeah. Wow. Oh my god. That tattoo hurt more than the boobs. That's a little bit risky. Yeah. Okay. Let's take a look at you, please. Okay. It doesn't hurt though. Okay, that's good. And that's I good. saw the picture of the. The implant? The, uh, the um, what is it? The stuff that was around it. The, the capsule? Yeah, you had you had a very, very. Uh, yeah. It was a very bad capsule. It was really scary. Yeah. I know, because they've been hurting me for a long time. And, I wanted to. And by the way, the, the right one had a capsule. Not yeah, as bad as one. the left one, but the left but one, was, one, too. Yeah, mm -hmm. one was terrible. And I, I would honestly like recommend that you probably stay without getting a lift, uh, your skin is thin from That's the old thing. implant. Yeah, yeah, they, when they went in through the first time, they, they, uh, they damaged a little bit of the gland and you were, you right shower immediately today. Yep. You can get those tapes wet. Okay. okay they, they'll dry it by themselves. We'll take them out in a week. Are you still here next week? No, I when, leave Sunday. You leave Sunday. Okay. Um, when you take the tapes off, the scar care is very, very simple. All I want you to do is obviously keep it nice and clean and dry, and then any of those um, over-the-counter products that they sell um, at CVS or Walgreens, the Scar Away, Scar, yeah, yeah, and you know the uh, the silicone strips that you can put on there yeah. that will help keep the scar nice and um, flat. Okay, there's yeah, nothing much. There's nothing much I would recommend at this point. Um, can you exercise? I would wait a month before you start exercising. But I can In like terms, run and bike, right? 
buy PS4 no. Okay, yeah, the, 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 and bike. if you're gonna run in the future, I would really wear a very supportive sports bra so because they're heavy. Yeah. Okay, um, the um, the one thing I wanted to tell you was yeah, not, no, not all the way. That's no, fine like that. Okay, um, you were asking if they were under the muscle or over the muscle. Mm -hmm. They were kind of both. Okay. Oh, their muscle, the yeah, their muscle was not in in, in perfect shape. There was, it was in two separate parts. Uh -huh. Okay. So there was no real integrity to the muscle for them to go under completely. Right. That that didn't the the muscle did not lend itself to that. It right. was from the previous surgery. It wasn't really in good shape. So it would have required more scarring and mm -hmm. uh, surgery that was not in my honest opinion necessary but the result on the table once we took out the the right. scar and took out the old implants and introduced the sizers and everything everything looked very nice so i decided to go with the implant because so is it under now it's it's not under the muscle the, i, I told okay. you the oh. muscle itself is it was not something. in good shape oh, okay. okay it was kind of split open okay. in the wrong place. Okay. So it would the the muscle would have never really covered the implant. Right. It would have been it would have required hanging off yeah. Yeah, it it was not it was not something that I would use. Right. Okay. There were the pocket was thick enough mm -hmm. that I think, you know, yeah. we should we I you know we needed to cut our losses and just maintain what we have. Mm -hmm. You have good enough skin, you have good quality of skin, the tissue was thick enough and I just went with the silicone implant and let's just keep our fingers crossed that you know this doesn't happen again okay, okay? um How, the, and you said there's no way of preventing you there's know? really not no way of preventing it okay yeah. there's really no way i obviously did the steps that we're supposed to do remove the old implant get rid of it remove the scar mm -hmm. the capsule completely and and you know make sure that everything is nice and clean and dry mm -hmm. but to go under the muscle was impossible there was the muscle was in two separate pieces Okay, it's already broken. Yeah, it is. So just, what do you need the muscle for? Just to pop the tip? Um, no, no. You know, the muscle, there's studies that show that if you put it under the muscle or partially under the muscle, it reduces the chance of having a capsule. Okay. Um, and it's a very small percentage. But in your case, the, the implant is big and your breasts are lower and the muscle is higher and the muscle is in two pieces so there is really nothing you can do right. about it okay? okay it wasn't under the muscle to start with it was okay. it maybe started there and it came out okay okay i take a picture of you okay <laughs> so everybody this is the crew the camera crew the manager <laughs> and the um model of jolie i had a great experience and connie and Minnie is in the getting their massage and we are done if y'all want any more follow-up make sure you follow jolie plastic surgery you can follow connie and ming to watch their stories and updates of how they're doing and i'll make another video updating but that was our plastic surgery mission for this time bye bye class bye. jolie bye, -bye.